Hi. So guys, basically, I, hold on. I'm going on holiday tomorrow and I'm so unprepared. Like, oh my God. It's actually five o'clock on Tuesday now. Our flight is until Thursday morning, but we're leaving to go to Bristol, me and my sister are, tomorrow at like 12-ish. And I'm so unprepared. Like, I've not packed a single thing, not chosen any outfits. All my clothes, I put like loads of washes, I put two washes on today to wash all my clothes that I need. They're still just satin flask, it's dirty. I think I meant wet, not dirty. Also, does anyone else call washing baskets washing flaskets? Like, a flask of washing? Because I only found out when I went to uni that that's not actually a word. My mum just calls them that, so we all just call them that in this household. So let me know if anyone else calls them a flasket because, sorry, I'm getting sidetracked. Anyway, we need to go to the shops now to get some stuff for our holiday. Like, I think we're going over to Boots because we need things like sun cream, moisturiser, etc, etc. So let me get dressed and then I'll get back to you. Right, so I'm in the car now with my sister. This is my outfit. I've got a really nice outfit on of a grey t-shirt, purple shorts, white socks, with my pink bags. I'm going to have to put my sunglasses on because I can't see anything and I need to drive. But um, anyway, let's go to Boots. So I'm back from Boots and it's half nine at night, guys. I came back from Boots and then we went to Sainsbury's and then, no, we went to Tesco's. I got this book, It Ends With Us, because I've wanted to read it for ages. But like a couple of my friends have copies of it, but like all their copies have been busy and I just wanted to read it on holiday. So I just had to cave and buy it. But um, so I got that book from Tesco's and then I went over to Izzy's and I got a couple other books because I had to give her a book anyway. I got Behind Closed Doors by B.A. Paris. And then I got The Sun Is Also A Star by Nicola Yoon. I've never heard of either of them, but I'm excited to read them. And I also got this book in the post today, Tupac Shakur, The Rose That Grew From Concrete. It's a book of all of Tupac's poetry. So I've been reading that today and that's been very good. I might take that with me, but before I go, I need to finish The Fine Print, which is also Izzy's. It's not the best book I've ever read. I've read quite a few books so far this summer. It's not, I think my favourite one I've read so far is either Love Hypothesis, Ugly Love, or On the Come Up was really good. It's by Angie Thomas, the same author that wrote The Hate You Give. Maybe I'll do an entire video about books because I love reading. I Every summer I get really into reading. And yeah, I might do a video of my book collection, but that's a video for another day. Anyway, so far, all the packing I've done for my holiday is I've made a pile of some of my bikinis. Some of them are on the air are drying still. I've got my face wash in a little bottle, but I've hardly got any face wash because it's running out. I've got my plug adapter. I've got a bottle of sun cream. And that's literally all I've done. So I need to now. I've also, for some reason, got four bottles of moisturiser all on the go. Because like, it's from like being down here and then like, I'll buy a new one to take back up to uni and like leave one down here. And I've really done that multiple times. But um, I'm gonna take this dress, I think, because it's flowy and loose. And I'll take, probably take these shorts. I'll take this skirt again, cause it's not loose. No, cause it is loose-ish. I might take, actually I'll take this skirt and not this skirt because they're quite similar or ish. I want to take this long skirt because I didn't wear it in Croatia. I took it with me, but I never wore it. So I'm going to try and wear that. And then tops, I'm going to just chuck in this dress as well, just because it's good to chuck on to go to the beach. Most of the tops I want to take are on the air right now, but there might be a few in here. Do I take this? I might take this top. I'm going to take like, I'm going to take like lots of random things because when I was in Croatia, I'm gonna basically try and take things that I didn't take to Croatia. I think that basically everything else I want to take is out in the conservatory. But I think me and my sister are just gonna pack in the morning. We haven't even figured out what suitcase we're taking yet. But um, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna go and try and finish this book. I've got, I've got this much left, but I've read like, I've read like this much today, this middle section here. So hopefully I can finish it. So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, vlog. I'm with my sister. <laughs> and um, we are about to pack for our holiday. It's like, what time is it, Lauren? I don't know. We don't know what time it is, maybe like nine o'clock. We've got to leave here at like half 11. Um, I've just made coffee. Goodbye. But um, 
Look, my skin is starting to break out. I've got a massive spot here, cluster of spots there. And I can feel like a cluster of spots coming on my chin. And I had that one there, but that one's going to be fair. But I'm just like, why now? Why me? Kill me. Um. Anyway, let me show you the rest of the clothes that I think I'm going to pack. This black skirt, this vest, love it. This vest. But this is literally what I took to Croatia. This white high neck vest, this black high neck vest, this purple vest, this nighty dress. Love it. And then I've just got like a load of pants, one pair of socks so far. Oh no, two pairs of socks. My white bucket hat, and then a couple more bikinis. But um, <coughs> I'm gonna take these shorts as well, I've just decided. We now need to go and fill one suitcase. So, see you shortly. Right, so our suitcase is packed. 5,000 arguments later. We are finally ready to go. <laughs> Running half an hour late, but you know what? Oh, look how cute Olive looks. You know what? These things, it's all part of the holiday experience. But um, we're about to leave now to drive up to Bristol and then our we've got a hotel to stay in tonight and then our flight is at like 6 a.m. tomorrow. So if I make out of this alive without murdering my sister or without my sister murdering me, then I'd say it's an accomplishment in itself. But I hope you guys thoroughly enjoyed this little pack with me moment. My shoes are Yeah. And I'll see you next time. Bye.